Hello everyone, this is Herothania. Welcome back to my playthrough of The Elder Scrolls V Skyrim. Previously, Davalos finished up and Troudhearth Barrow. We took out a dragon at Northwind Summit and bought a house in Whiterun. Breeze Home. Now we have to climb the 7,000 steps to High Rothgar. That's a lot of steps. Let me guess. Someone stole your sweet roll. Currently in the town of Iverstead. And we have to climb the mountain to High Rothgar. For the quest, The Way of the Voice. On your way up the 7,000 steps again, Clement? Not today. I'm just not ready to make the climb to High Hrothgar. The path isn't safe. Aren't the Greybeards expecting some supplies? Honestly, I'm not certain. I've yet to be allowed into the monastery. Perhaps one day. Let's talk to Klimek here. Passing through on your way to High Hrothgar? About to make a delivery up there myself. Anything you can tell me about High Hrothgar? I've been to the monastery many times, but I've never even laid eyes on one of the Greybeards. Not that I'd care to. Being masters of Bethuam, they could kill you by uttering a single word. Hmm. Well, not that they would. They seem peaceful, but I wouldn't want to provoke them. Okay. What types of deliveries do you make to High Rothgar? Mostly food supplies like dried fish and salted meats. You know, things that keep fresh for a long time. The Greybeards tend not to get out much, if you catch my meaning. And in return? Well, it's kind of an understanding between us. I mean, it just wouldn't feel right to charge them for a bit of preserved food. Trouble is, my legs aren't what they used to be, and climbing the 7,000 steps takes its toll. I could do it for you. Really? Well, that would be kind of you. Here, take this bag of supplies. At the top of the steps, you'll see the offering chest. Just leave the bag inside, and you're done. All right. Klimek supplies added. Bring the supplies to High Rothgar. Anything I should watch out for during the climb? Well, there's the occasional wolf pack or stray, but that's all I've ever had to deal with. Shouldn't be a problem for the likes of you. Other than that, watch your footing. In these wintry conditions, the stairs can be treacherous. Then there are the Frost Trolls. Be careful up there. You didn't mention the Frost Trolls. Bring the supplies to High Rothgar. So, time to climb the 7,000 steps. Ah, what's this? An etched tablet. Emblem 1. Before the birth of men, the dragons ruled all Mundus. Their word was the voice, and they spoke only for true needs. For the voice could blot out the sky and flood the land. Any critters ahead? A uh, spider. <laughs> hey, Spidey. Gotcha, Spidey. Hmm. 
Lovely view of the town. Even that barrow in the distance. Hello there, mountain goat. Ah, uh, who's this? Barknar? Keep an eye out for wolves if you're headed up the path to High Hrothgar. Did you hear the Greybeards call Dovahkiin? I did. Strange days when the monks will do that. I wonder what it means. What are you doing? I like to spend time up here. Walk the steps. Meditate on the emblems. Doesn't hurt when I bag some game along the way. Do you visit the Greybeards? They're not the sort to take visitors. But I never go that high up the path anyway. Some folk who make the trip leave them food or other essentials, but not to make conversation. All right. I. Pardon me, Barknar. Another etched tablet, emblem two. Men were born and spread over the face of Mundus. The dragons presided over the crawling masses. Men were weak then and had no voice. Any critters up ahead? A wolf, an ice wolf. Take that, Wolfie. An ice wolf pelt. Bad puppy, an amethyst. What's a wolf doing with an amethyst? Anything this way? Oh, hello, goat. Another etching. Emblem 3. The fledgling spirits of men were strong in old times, unafraid, unafraid to war with dragons and their voices, but the dragons only shouted them down and broke their hearts.
someone's at that tablet. Hello there. Keep an eye out for wolves if you're headed up the path to High Rothgard. Good morning. Yeah? Did you hear the Greybeard's call to Vakin? I was just outside Iverstead when it happened. It's an exciting moment. Nothing like this has happened in centuries. Who are you? Just a pilgrim. I'd prefer to leave it at that, if you don't mind. Okay. What are you doing? Walking the steps. Meditating on the emblems. I make this trip every few years. Until next time. Until then. Emblem 4. Kine called on Parthernex, who pitied man. Together they taught men to use the voice. Then Dragon War raged. Dragon against tongue. And ahead, start looking out for frost trolls. There's one. Pretty powerful. And loaded with help. Ah, oh, thank you. No sign up. Keep an eye out for wolves if you're headed up the path to High Rothka. Not to mention the frost trolls. Very nasty frost trolls.
another tablet. Emblem 5. Man prevailed, shouting Alduin out of the world. Proving for all that their voice was too strong, although their sacrifices were manifold. Any other trolls about? Emblem 6, with roaring tongues, the Sky Children conquer, founding the First Empire with sword and voice, whilst the dragons withdrew from this world. So, Emblem 6... Another emblem off to the side. Emblem 7. The tongues at Red Mountain went away humbled. Jurgen Windcaller began his seven-year meditation to understand, to understand how strong voices could fail. And another tablet. Emblem 8. Jurgen Wincoller chose silence and returned. The seventeen disputants could not shoot him down. Jurgen the Calm built his home on the throat of the world. And there it is, High Rothgar. Emblem 9. For years all silent, the Greybeards, sp the Greybeards spoke one name. Tiber Septum, stripling then, was summoned to Hrothgar. They blessed him. They blessed and named him Dovakin. And here we are, High Rothgar. And here's the chest. For Klimic supplies. Return to Klimic.
back down to Klimek. Might as well do that now. Hello, Clement. I wish I could make my deliveries more often, but the road's getting dangerous. Ah, good to see you again. How'd that delivery go? I delivered the supplies to High Rothgar. Quite a climb, wasn't it? Anyway, much appreciated. Here, take this for your troubles. A good bit of gold. Thank you. Thanks again for the legwork. Now then. I think I'll revisit that dragon at Northwind Summit and harvest his bones. Ah, yes, nasty trolls. I'm not fond of trolls. There's the dragon skeleton. We'll get his bones. And let's head over to Whiterun and see if we can sell them off. Hello again, White Run. Old friend, patron of the great clan Battleborn. There's a nip in the air. Cold won't be good for my crops. Never is. Oh, Bellathor. Got something for just about everybody in here. Give a holler if you have any questions. Okay. Everything's for sale, my friend. Everything. If I had a sister, I'd sell her in a second. Huh. Oh, a bit of this and a bit of that. Got some dragon stuff for you. Speech goes up. Let's see, Bellathor. Healing and magic of potions. Oh, a bit of this and a bit of that. Candlelight. Voila. Do come back. If we must. Spell tome candlelight creates a hovering light that lasts for sixty seconds. Oh, I already know it. Oops. I'd even buy one of your relatives if you're looking to sell. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's, that's a little joke. I bet. Take a look. Remember, I'll give you the best deals or die trying. I work for Bellafield. Come by Bellathor's shop at the market. I'm sure we've got something you need. Someone come in here. Ah, 
Ah, oh, it's my house, Carl Lydia. Long life to you, Thane. Thank you, Lydia. Now you cannot store quest items such as Meridia's beacon. I'm right behind you. What do you want me to carry? Let's see, Fandel. I'll take some things to store. What do you want me to carry? You lead, I'll follow. Ah, this Dark Brotherhood Assassin's note. Someone apparently wants me dead. Treasure map 4. I wonder where that is. Okay. Later, Lydia. Now we'll fast travel back to High Rothgar. And next time we'll go inside to talk to the Greybeards. This is Hey Rotlinia. I'd like to thank you for watching, and I'll see you again next time.